and I'm here with my March favorites for you. Um, I know I'm super late, but I know, I, I feel like I say this every video, I'm super late, but it's better late than never, so here we go. Um, start off with some a skincare product, and this, I, for some reason my skin has just been acting up. It's been getting super dry, which it never ever ever does, but still oily like in my T-zone. Um, and I've been switching out my cleansers and moisturizers to try and figure out something that works for me right now. And this is one product that has definitely been a saving grace. This is the Clear Pore Cleanser and Mask from Neutrogena. Um, I do the mask probably about twice, two to three times a week, and then I use this cleanser um, every night before I go to bed. And it's just, it's got benzoyl peroxide, which for me works so much better than salic salicylic acid. <laughs> but um, yeah, it just does such a good job at kind of like getting all the gunk out of here. Because I've been breaking out too, which is just totally weird. Like, I've been getting like huge pimples. Um, and I haven't had that in a long time, so whenever that happens, I always pick this up, and it never fails to amaze me. Um, so that's that. And you can get this at the drugstore for like six bucks. Um, that's like an all-time favorite product. Um, a hair product that I've been using all the time, every day, is this Big Sexy Hair um, Powder Play. It's a volumizing and texturizing powder, and if you've never used this before, um, it basically just looks like a baby powder bottle. And what you do is like you section off your hair and you put the powder in by the roots and shake your hair and like kind of like work the product into the roots and it really gives you lift and height. And whenever, normally I try, I tease my hair to kind of give it like super height and like kind of make it last a little bit longer but there's days in the morning where I really don't have time to do that and I just throw a bunch of this stuff in and it kind of does it all for me. I just throw it in, shake my hair, and then I'm done and then I can go about my day. Um, I got this at, I think, a Rite Aid. I know Target has it. it just check your drugstores because I know drugstores sell this too. Um, it's a little bit more expensive. You might want to try and check out like a salon, um, a beauty supply store for a better price. Um, I think at Rite Aid this was like 14 bucks, which I know is kind of expensive. Rite Aid has a little bit more. I feel like they just kind of bump up their prices a little bit more. Um, but yeah, I really, really do like this, and I kind of need to get another one. Uh, Alright, on to makeup. I have been... I... <laughs> I tried out a new foundation um, simply because Pixie 2 Woo uses it in almost every one of her videos and it's the Clinique Super Balanced um, Foundation. I got this in the color Nude Beige and it's just a super awesome foundation, especially for me right now. Um, basically what this does, it's a smart, it says on the back, it's a smart makeup base. Absorbs oil where oil control is needed and moisturizes where hydration is needed. Slips on the skin easily, oil free, shake well before using. Um, it's a good coverage foundation, um, but it does just that. It really does kind of balance everything out for me. If I have any dry patches, it really kind of covers them well, but it stays in the places that are a little bit more oily. Uh, when I first put this on, I put this on with a brush, which is a huge, 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 huge mistake, especially if you don't, I mean, unless you like super, super full coverage foundation, putting this on with a brush will just mask everything out and I do kind of like my natural skin to show through so I um, what's it called I started using this with my hands and that works so much better so what I'll do is I'll pour this out into my hands kind of dot it all over my face and then like use my hands to really massage it in oh, what's going on with my phone um, to really massage it in and then um, I'll take a brush like this Sonia Kashuk um, there's like no number on here, but it's like a flat top um, synthetic brush to really just kind of work everything into like the nooks and crannies because it is a thicker foundation and I really wanted to, I really just want to make sure that I've blended everything as best that I can. <clears throat> um, but yeah, I absolutely love this foundation and it's like half the price of every other foundation that I've been purchasing for ever. It's like 24 bucks, 25 bucks. Um, and it's a great, great, great foundation. So if you're looking for something a little bit more expensive than a drugstore, but not quite high end, this is an awesome, awesome foundation. Um, along with that, I've been really going back to, I kind of go back and forth on concealer. I've been using that Age Erase stuff. 
I was using that for a while and then um, I kind of I went back to using like my Bobbi Brown stuff and then that ran out um, and I just went back to using my MAC um, what is this called studio finish concealer seriously like the best concealer that I've used for the money it's like I actually can't remember how much this is it this is it lasts forever um, I have this in MW25 and I use this under my eye and I use it to cover up any sort of you know blemishes and pimples I had two colors of this and I ran out one for like blemishes and then one for like under eye circles but I yeah I really like this stuff I really need to get a new one just because I haven't I've been using this forever it just goes on it goes on a little bit drier I think but the it lasts all day which is key for me because waking up in the morning and then going to work and then going to the gym at night or going out I really need something to last all day because I do have bags under my eyes I do have dark circles mm -hmm. and this is a concealer that never sees never ceases to amaze me um, for my brows I actually picked up this brow pen from Anastasia this was a little bit expensive I think it was like around $20 um, it's a long wearing brow tint and it's a brow pen so this is what the tip looks like um, it's basically what you do is it's meant to kind of have really fine like a really fine tip and kind of be able to mimic natural hair and I've used this on my brow I've been using this ever since I got it and I absolutely love it it does it lasts all day um, it's super easy my eyebrows never look too done um, I will say though that the color is a little bit too warm for me so what I'll do is I'll go back in with something like um, let me see put something like wedge over it just lightly to dust it to kind of take away that warm brown um, I wish they made this in more colors I think it was it was just really like a blonde and then a brown and the brunette was just is just too warm but it's a really great product and lasts long and if you throw the powder on to kind of mute it out a little bit it's perfect um, so I really like that um, and a lip gloss that I have been absolutely just loving over everything is my creme sheen glass in boy bait um, I think I need to get another one this is like I never run out of lip glosses and when I run out of this I think I'll be super super sad it's a really pretty nude pink um, for me when I first apply it it looks a little like weird so I kind of have to like work it into my lips a little bit more um, my lips are pigmented but once I kind of work it in, it's it's just perfect um, I get the most compliments when I wear this lip gloss and it, I've been using this actually on top of another favorite which is my Nicki Minaj Viva Glam lipstick um, which is like a Barbie pink color and I the, the combination of these two makes it is so wearable for day but you still look done let me put a little bit of this on top so this is the combination together and it's just so it it just I don't know I love 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 this combination it just looks so pretty and pink and girly so yeah I need to curl up my look a little bit sometimes um, anyways that's that and so those are all of my March favorites I don't know if you can hear my neighbors playing like ridiculously loud music right now but anyways um, I hope you guys enjoyed that if you guys have any questions about the products that I mentioned leave me a comment down below and I will get back to you um, like this video comment and share um, and I'll see you guys in the next video